everyone and welcome to my YouTube channel. All right, here's the crowd. Please are the fan favorite, Danger's Dad, Donald Cowboy Cerrone. And I bring up his son, Danger, because every interview Donald now does, he brings it to his son. And he says, maybe before I wasn't motivated by the belt and becoming a champion, now with the son in tow, his eyes are on the prize. We all find motivation in different ways, but across the board, you can see guys, as they get families and as they have children, they can see the motivation physically. He looks at danger and he sees a reason why he should be his very best. He's shown that in this latest run in the UFC lightweight division. Most wins in UFC history, Donald Cerrone. Most finishes in UFC history, Cowboy Cerrone. He will look to add to those totals here in this spot tonight. Right, here he is, DC. In my mind, this is the most dominant force in the MMA game today. The undisputed UFC lightweight champion, your AKA teammate, Khabib Nurmagomedov. Yeah, and for Khabib, it's the well-rounded skill set that has propelled him to one of the longest undefeated streaks in mixed martial arts history. No missteps, no mistakes, no underestimation of opponents. Always prepared, always ready to go, and he can rely on his the coaching he gets. Also on the ability that he has to carry him to victory time and time again. Wrestling, samba, jiu-jitsu, striking, the guy has it all. I know you listed striking last, but your head coach, Javier Mendez, says sometimes he's going southpaw in yeah. training. We haven't seen just how good a striker he is. We saw shades in the McGregor fight. Yes. But not completely. But technically, he has so many skills that he has not even displayed to the MMA community yet. All right, another big spot for Khabib Nurmagomedov here tonight. Or till the date for this, our main event of the evening. Nurmagomedov is 31. Cerrone is 37. He is three inches taller. He will have a three inch reach advantage. And once again, Ladies here is the veteran voice of the this octagon, Bruce the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon is Herb Dean. This is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Madison Square Garden Arena in New York City. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. It's what is he first? Fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a Muay Thai kickboxer, holding a professional record of 36 wins, 16 losses, one draw, and one no contest. He stands six feet one inch tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Fighting out of Albuquerque, New Mexico, Donald Cowboy Cerrone. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a grappler, holding a professional record of 29 wins, no losses. He stands by feet 10 inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Fighting out of the Republic of Dagestan, Russia, Habib the Eagle, You can give me your instruction in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves, let's make it official. They touch him up, and we are underway. Ready. All right, so here we go. This highly anticipated fight is now underway. Looks like a classic matchup of striker versus grappler. Am I simplifying things too much? In this instance, you aren't, because this is what got these two men to the show. Right. One guy is known for his diverse attack on the feet. The other guy is known for his ability to drag the fight to the mat and put his opponents in danger from the very start of the grappling exchanges. Punch land. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. All collar tie. 
side control DC this is where you want to be now because you get to make your opponent decide they try to turn back into you you can attack guillotine if they turn away to try to get to your knees you throw your hooks in and you got all your rear choke submission lands a strike now from the bottom nice work there by Navago Medov throws the right hand there man this is some serious ground and pound he's trying to put this dude's head like through the canvas He's one of the better ground and pound fighters you have in the entire UFC, and you're seeing why. And he's back up. Effective punch there by the Mago Medov. He engages in the single collar guy. Looking to land the right just wow. out of the Actually got the take now. So he's sort of turtled up here, not great body language. Perhaps he's trying to bait him in a little bit. Now trying to hip escape. He's just trying to move out of this position off the bottom. The Kimura is not the arm. It's the shoulder pressure that usually makes you tap. But now DC trying to isolate an arm. Yep, he's using the Kimura. Oh, now he's in trouble. So the fighter was really caught in the submission there just as the horn sounded. Safe to say he was saved by the bell there. So back there? to the stools Let's they go. go. 60 Let's seconds to recover here. We're going to fight on, ladies and gentlemen. Another round coming up. Keep moving your feet. Cut those angles. And let's keep... Round two is here. Khabib Nurmagomedov. Right. And Donald Cowboy Cerrone. Oh, he's got it going now. Nice connection there, DC. Another punch land. Big body kick land. And he landed the right hand there. Single collar tie now. Stuff the takedown, no problem. He lands a switch knee. Oh! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. have landed for Donald Cowboys. And if you care at home, the accuracy right now, 50. Now trying to hip escape. He's just trying to move out of this position off the bottom. The Kimura is not the arm. It's the shoulder pressure that usually makes you tap. But now DC trying to isolate an arm. Yep, he's using the Kimura. Oh! He's got the turn on the elbow, and he's going to chase the submission finish. Kimura finish by this great fighter. And I don't care how high your threshold is for pain. When you're in that compromised state, better to tap and fight another guy. It's so crazy because people think the pressure's on your arm. It's all your shoulder. When somebody has a really good Kimura, it feels like they're going to break your shoulder. That's why you have to tap. as he gets it done by submission tonight, champ. Just watch how slowly he approaches the submission, though. He never rushes. He takes his time, but it's his trickiness. It's his ability to trick people into going to the floor with him that puts them in danger in finishing fights.
So there he is, your winner by submission. That is a finish they will likely be talking about for some time. Big win, major statement made to the rest of this division. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean is called to stop this contest at two minutes, two seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by tap out. All right, so there he is, all smiles, and rightfully so, after he gets the job done by submission tonight. You told me off the air before the fight that he was going to submit him, and that's exactly what happened. I mean, you know, this guy has such a great submission game that you can't... Thank you for watching. Please wait for more videos. See you soon. ...to lay in the guard. He made a pay for tonight. That's submission.